This is a video demo showing how to palpate the bony landmarks on the proximal humerus. The demo is on right arm. Let's start from locating the bicipital groove on the humerus. First, locate the long head tendon of biceps on the anterosuperior aspect of humerus. If you are not sure if you are on it, ask your patient to flex the elbow against a resistance. Follow along the muscle superiorly onto the long head tendon. The tendon sits on the groove. So you feel more the tendon on it, not much of the groove itself. The bicipital groove is also called the intertubercular groove because it is between the two tubercles. Once you locate the groove we can palpate the next structure. What is the attachment site for three of rotator cuff muscles? That's right. The greater tubercle. After locating the most superior portion of tendon, move laterally. Just make sure that you are not on the acromion, the tip of shoulder. Drop immediately off inferiorly from the acromion onto the head of humerus. Now you are on the greater tubercle. Try to feel full size of it through the deltoid tissue. From the greater tubercle, move medially and pass the tendon in its groove just a bit medial to it. Now you are on the lesser tubercle. Which one of rotator cuff muscles is attached onto? Yes? Subscapularis. Now we are going to palpate the neck of humerus. There are the anatomical neck and the surgical neck. The anatomical neck is superior to two tubercles and the surgical neck is inferior to two tubercles. The anatomical neck is hard to distinguish due to the layers of muscles, ligament, joint capsule and other connective tissue. The surgical neck is the narrowing part of humerus inferior to two tubercles. After passing the surgical neck, you are palpating the shaft of humerus. The last structure we are going to locate is the deltoid tuberosity. The deltoid tuberosity is located on the lateral side of the midhumeral shaft. It is the attachment point of the deltoid muscle. To locate it, palpate the deltoid muscle along inferiorly and feel for the tapering distal end of the deltoid and where it is attached. Feel for a small round rough and bony projection. That is the deltoid tuberosity. The palpating finger should be halfway point between the shoulder and elbow. This is it for the palpation of the bony landmarks on the proximal humerus. Thank you for watching.